person of conscious is smart and I'm here to take you to mathematics or algebraic expression. In our previous lesson, we did talk of addition and subtraction of algebraic expression. So let's have a record of what we did. We have this expression 3a plus 4b plus a minus 2b. Okay. So before we solve it, we have to check whether we have like terms in. Okay. You can see we have 3a here, we also have 2a. We have 4b here, we have minus 2b. That means we can group them. Yes, yeah. so we should group. I'm going to get 3a plus a and um, 4b minus 2b. From here, as we all know. I will add the coefficient of the like terms. Yes. This the coefficient of this term is three. And the coefficient of this a is one as we already said. So we are going to add the coefficient. So three plus one. This gives us an answer of four. From there we add the variable which is a. Yeah. We have variable b variable b here. So we are going to uh deal with the coefficient. Yes, we have four minus two. As we all know, 4 minus 2 is what? 2. Then we add the variable which is b. So this is the answer for the expression. Yes, we can't add this term to this term because they are not like terms. They are not like terms. Okay. Our topic for today is substitution. 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 Yes, when we talk of substitution, as we all know, it means to change. To what? To change. Even let's consider the footballers. And when they play the ball and get to a time, they substitute, they change. Yes, one gets out and one coming. So here we are going to substitute variables by numbers or variables by constant. Yes, we are going to change, we are going to replace. So most of the time, we do that by reading the preamble given. Okay, let's have an example. Oh. Yes, as you put in here, substitution means to change or replace something by another. Yes, so let's try example. Let's read the example. Solve this when a is equal to 4, b is equal to 2. That means wherever you see a, you are going to put what there is. And wherever you see b, you are going to put what there is. That means we are going to substitute a by what? 4. And also substitute b by what? 2. So when we look at the example, yes, here, there is no light in here. So what we are going to do is that we are going to substitute, since we have a and b here, Yes, when you read the problem, you say solve this where a is equal to 4 and b is equal to what? 2. So wherever you see a, you put 4 there. Wherever you see b, you put 2 there. Okay. So in mathematics, when you see something like this, 3a, it means that 3 is multiplying the a and the 2 is multiplying the b. So wherever you see a, you are going to put 4 there. So 3 into bracket 4 plus 2 into bracket 2. Yes. When you get something like this, it means the number in the box is multiplying the one outside. Or the one outside is multiplying the, the number in the box. Here to 2 is multiplying this 2. So let's multiply. 3 times 4 gives us an answer of 12. Plus 2 times 2 gives us an answer of what? 4. 12 plus 4 is 16. Yes. 
after substitute, you did multiply. 3 by 4. You multiply 2 by 2. We had 4. From there, you did our simple addition, which gives us an answer of 16. So this is the answer for this expression. Whereby we are going to replace, uh, replace or substitute this a by the 4 and the b by the 2. Okay, let's try another example. Yes, we have an expression over here. 3b plus 2a minus 2b plus 3c plus 5b. Yes, so for this expression, we are going to arrange them. You see, we have some like terms in it, so we are going to group the like the terms. Okay, so we have 3b here, we also have minus 2b here. We have 2a here, we also have 5b here, we have c here. So let's arrange them. We are going to get 3b. This minus sign is affecting the 2b, not affecting this 2a, it's affecting this 2b. So minus 2b plus 2a, we also have 5a here, plus 5a plus 3c. Yes, as you can see, this and this are the same, so we are going to deal with the coefficient. 3 minus 2 gives us an answer of 1, then we add the variable which is here. As I said earlier, you know, the work expression. When a variable is written without a coefficient, it's considered to have a coefficient of 1. So the 1 can be cancelled. Or we can clean the 1 from there. Then we get normal B. Data. Here we have 2a plus 5a. 2a plus 5a. The variables are the same. Therefore, we are going to add the coefficient, the numerical coefficient. 2 plus 5 gives us an answer of 7. From there, add the variable, which is what? A. Here, 3c is left. Yes, it has no term over here. It has no light term over here. So we are going to. I repeat it 3c from here you can't add any of these terms because they are not live because they are not live so you go back to the prayer but we say where a is equal to what three so wherever you see you what i'm going to put there three wherever you see what i'm going to put there two wherever you see what i'm going to put there four so uh, b is two plus seven a is what three plus the rest is what? 4. So as we all know, we are going to multiply. We here gives us an answer of 2. Here, there is no number which we are going to put it. Plus 7, 3, 21. Plus 3 times 4 gives us an answer of 4. And so we are going to do our simple addition. 2 plus 21 is 23. 23 plus 12 is 35. That means. We did after grouping them after grouping them uh, we did the substitution we replaced uh, the variables by what numbers we replaced the variables by the numbers since they say a is equal to three whatever is e it means a way to put them so we did that yes and then we did our multiplication and did our normal addition and we have this okay let's try another example As we all know, um, we are going to group like terms. So we have 6a here, we have 5a here. So 6a plus 5a. We have 3b, 5b. So 3b plus 5b. Also, we also have 2c. We are left with only 2c. 
from them, we do our simple calculations, our simple addition. Since the variables are the same, we add the coefficient. 6 plus 5 gives us an answer of 11. Then we add our variables to start A. The variables are the same, so we are going to add the numerical coefficient. 3 plus 5 is what? 8. Then we add the variable plus B. Yeah. 2 has no term, it has no right term. So we just repeat it. Yes, we are done with this. We are done with the grouping and addition. So here we can see that you can't add phenomenon because the terms are not like, they are not like. So from there, we just substitute. We are going to substitute. Okay. So A is what 5, so 11 into bracket 5. Plus. The B is what 7. And um, C is what 2. This 11 times 5 gives us an answer of 55 plus 5, 8 times 7 gives us an answer of 58, 56 plus 2 times this gives us an answer of 4, yes, as we all know, 4, 4 plus um, 58 is 60, so 60 plus 55. Yes, as we all know, if we add 55 to 60, we are going to get 115. 115. 115. Yes, so, this is the answer for the expression. Whereby we substitute 5 uh, into A, 7 into B, and C uh, into 2 or 2 C. Okay. So um, I'm sure we are all clear with it. So let's try this at home.